Oh, you guys want to come say hi? No, sit. 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 Sit down. Sit your butt. Sit. Sit your booty. Bendy, sit. Sit down. Sit. Okay, come in. Oh, sit, Bubba. Sit. Oh, it's so good, boy. It's delicious. Sit. Jeez, Louise, woman. Sit. Gentle. Gentle. Oh. <laughs> there he goes. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to... Come on. Uh, welcome back to a, another vlog. I have not vlogged in so long like i think it's been a few months like since we moved here that i've vlogged but i have been dying to do this vlog specifically because i am so excited like i'm literally oh my god i'm so excited i've been waiting for this like week for so so freaking long this people very exciting is bachelorette week leading up to my bachelorette let me, okay, I didn't say that. That wasn't like as exciting as I was expecting it to be. This is the week leading up to my bachelorette party. So I decided that I was going to vlog like a few bits and pieces of my bachelorette party, whatever I feel comfortable vlogging and whatever I could get. Um, so I figured that I would kind of do the week leading up as well Like me preparing to go on this trip and that kind of stuff because I love seeing people's vlogs when they're like packing and like getting all ready and stuff Um, and yeah, this is just a really busy fun week for me Leading up to a very busy fun weekend for me. So I'm so 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 excited Um, you guys will be seeing this the week after I return hopefully <laughs> So we're currently coming. Hey! 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 So we are going Friday to Sunday, but I'm staying an extra day. I'm coming back on Monday. So I'm hoping to get this up like midweek, whatever. We'll figure it out. Um, but yeah, I'm just really, really excited. I've never been in Nashville before. I've heard so many great things. So it's going to be amazing. Um, so yeah, today is currently Tuesday. June 18th, um, it's about three o'clock in the afternoon. I've just been out running errands all day pretty much and I actually just got my hair done this morning. Oh my God, she killed it. Um, I just got my blonde freshened up. You can't even tell in this lighting, but it just looks so good. And I actually got a few inches off my extensions. I had 24 inches, which hit about right here. So now I'm at like 22, 21 ish. So my hair is nice and fresh for the big weekend and everything. And then tomorrow I am actually getting eyelash extensions and an eyebrow tint. So I really wanted to vlog that whole experience as well because I've never had any of that done before and I thought it would just be really, really fun. Um, so yeah, I just got home like 20 minutes ago or so. I grabbed a little coffee on the way home. Um, this is just a, what did I get? Just a small Americano, black, no cream or anything. I'm trying to be good this week leading up. So I actually went to TJ Maxx because I am a cereal overpacker. Like, it's horrible. And since I'm only going away for a weekend, I just kind of want to do carry-on situations. Also, because I don't have a direct flight, I'm changing over in Charlotte. Um, so I have like a little like hard shell carry-on suitcase, but I wanted like a tote bag or something like that that I could like stack on top and like throw my makeup bag in, some other stuff, random, like whatever didn't fit my suitcase, in addition to like wallet, that kind of thing. This is the bag I got and it's like the perfect travel size. I think this print is hideous. I hate the color of this. I think it's so ugly but it's the only one I could find that was like the perfect size, had all the straps I needed, and like just had so many good pockets and stuff like that. 
um it has this like huge front compartment with so many other pockets here that i can keep like headphones all that kind of stuff in i have these front zipper pockets here that i can keep cards money whatever my phone and then it has this back pocket here and then this whole huge compartment with like a few more pockets and stuff so again i think this is super hideous but it was literally 34 dollars so i couldn't pass it up there's a steve madden one that was really cute it was like the same quilted material but it was a camel print and i loved it but it was like half the size and this is just like perfect travel size you know what i mean like this is this is amazing so i can throw in like an extra pair of shoes if i need to i can fit all my toiletries my makeup bag that kind of thing basically anything that i can't fit into my big suitcase um, and it's also like a good weekender bag just to have. You can wear it crossbody like this, or I'll probably just carry it like a tote like this and like stick it on top of my rolly bag like that. This is gonna be like a very random vlog because I'm just gonna show you bits and pieces of what's been going on and all that kind of stuff. I just, you know, I'm not totally sure how much footage I'm gonna get from the weekend itself. So I thought that I would just start vlogging and that way you guys have a little bit more content. Um, right now I'm just doing some like email and stuff. I'm watching a little bit of YouTube, watching some other vlogs, just relaxing. Um, I'm going to make dinner in like two or so hours, just waiting for Nick to get home. So yeah, that's pretty much the update and I will check in with you guys later. What is up you guys? So it is currently, I don't even know what time it is one o'clock um so i didn't pick up my camera till later today because i've been at my lash appointment all morning um i didn't really do anything exciting today besides i went to spin class this morning and then like made myself breakfast and stuff and my lash and brow appointment was at 10 so i had to drive about 25 minutes to that um so yeah these are what my lashes are looking like and i did get a brow tint um i love it this is my first experience with lash extensions i've never had them before i've also never had a brow tint before so i'm super excited how it came out my brows are thin but that's just like their natural shape um i got them waxed up a little bit i'll probably still have to fill them in just to like shape them a little bit more and like add some thickness because i have spindly brows to begin with but i think they look so good and my lashes oh there's a bug Ugh. um but my lashes i think look phenomenal they feel really good they're super super long and like nice and wispy um if you're wondering i got a cc curl and she did a mix of 16 and 12s i think for length and then i just got a henna tint on my brows so i'm wearing glasses today and obviously no makeup because i didn't want to wear contacts for like two hours with my eyes closed um but i just got to the ulta parking lot it's right behind me right there um i need to pick up some travel things so i'm gonna run in and do that and then i'm gonna head home when i get home i'm gonna start packing so i will show you what i picked up from ulta and some other stuff that i've picked up and yeah we'll get the show on the road do not mind this mess and such um i'm in one of our spare bedrooms that we literally have no furniture in and this is where i like keep my shoes and like handbags and stuff like that and i've just like laid out my suitcase here and started putting together a few outfits like i said yesterday um but before i start packing everything up um oh let me give you like an up close of my lashes now you can see what i got i mean look how good they look I'm excited. Of course, I have like the biggest, most painful breakout right now, but I think that's like hormonal. Oh, and also I have a new set. I don't know if I mentioned that to you guys. Oh, oh, you want to say hello? Okay, okay. Um, they're like this. It's not picking up the color like really well on this camera in this lighting, but it's like a neon blue pink color um and i <laughs> oh okay and i have um almond shape i actually do my own sets and fills show you everything that i picked up from ulta some of this stuff is for this trip and then some of the stuff i just saw and was like i really like that um so i got this like headband so i have one of these already um it's just like a plush headband kind of thing 
but the one I have is so tight on my head, especially with my extensions. Like it just like presses in all the wrong places and it's so painful. I usually can use it for like 10 minutes and then I have to take it off. Um, so I just thought this would be fun to have. Come on. Oh my God, this is so obnoxious. I love it. Oh, this one's so much softer and like stretchier and yes, bitch. Amazing. So you'll probably see this in a few upcoming tutorials. <laughs> Just to keep my hair out of my face. I got a uh, mini Batiste um, in the blush one, whatever. I think they all smell really good. I personally do not really have a preference. Um, and then I got my Bumble and Bumble Thickening Dry Spun Texture Spray. Um, I'm obsessed with this lately. So I wanted to have a mini to take with me. Um, and then I also got a mini living proof full dry volume blast. So this is for instant long lasting volume and texture. So it's kind of the same thing, but I use this in my roots and I use this like as like a hairspray kind of thing. I don't know. I've only used this like a few times like twice maybe, um, but I just thought I would bring it along with me, see how it goes. I don't wanna use, cause I'm gonna wash my hair again on Friday, I don't wanna go in straight with dry shampoo. I try and hold off on dry shampoo because it's very drying for your hair. So I try and hold off as long as possible, but I really just want like a lot of volume, so that's what that's for. Um, and then I got the Sally Hansen Airbrush Legs Leg Makeup. Um, this is the water resistant one and I got mine in the tone medium. Ooh, what? This is like orange shit. Um, I should have probably tested this, but I just feel bad using stuff that like people might <gasps> buy. Right now, I do not have a ounce of self tanner on, like literally none. I've been scrubbing it off like a maniac because I want a fresh one for this weekend. That makes you bronzy. So this is just like a smoothing makeup. Um, I have some veins and stuff on my legs that I don't know, I just wanna kinda like take care of. Then I also got a new Mario Badesco drying lotion. This is the plastic bottle. I always had the glass prior to this, but it just makes more sense to have plastic. So I got that cause I'm out of it and I also wanna bring it with me just in case. I always have a spot treatment with me. And then I picked up a new oil-free eye makeup remover from Neutrogena just because with my lash extensions now, I have to use oil-free products. Um, so I'm gonna have to transfer this into a smaller travel container as well as this guy, which I did get something for that. Um, and then I just picked up another M504 fluffy, like huge fluffy brush. Um, I thought I got one of these for my kit, like another one for my kit, but I ended up buying a different brush, so I finally got the one that I needed. And then I got two products from Cover FX. I finally got the freaking gripping primer that everyone has been obsessed with. Oh my god. This has been sold out, like, always. So I'm really excited, and I'm gonna take this with me, actually, and play around with it, I think, because... It's gonna be so hot and my makeup is gonna be disgusting. So we're definitely gonna need some of that. Um, and then I don't know what makeup I'm taking. I haven't like packed that yet, but I think I'm definitely gonna take this guy with me. And then I think I'm gonna take these two. These are the Cover FX Mattifying Booster Drops. You just basically like mix these into your foundation, right? Instantly mattify your complexion with these innovative multi-use drops. Instantly matte skin and blur imperfections. Can be added to your favorite liquid beauty products or used alone for a super boost of mattification for combo oily skin types. So this is what they look like. They're huge. So actually, I don't know if I'm going to be able to take these. No, they're only one fluid ounce. Wow, the dropper is like silver too. That's wild. But this is what they look like there. And then I actually had to run to CVS as well. And I got... I had to get a new deodorant. I can actually take this out of the carton. Um, dude, I tried the natural deodorant route. I really, really did, but that fucking sucked. Like, it was so bad. I was so smelly. Um, and also, I realized finally, once I did make it through the detox period of like two weeks of using the natural deodorant, like, I stopped stinking, but I was sweating still. So, I need a deodorant that's an antiperspirant as well. 
I didn't know that deodorant and antiperspirant were two different things. Like deodorant is only for scent. So I'm back on the aluminum breast cancer giving stuff, whatever. It just works the best for me. I also got a mini contact solution because this is really thrilling stuff here, you guys. Um, that doesn't come with a new case. That's lit. Um, and then I picked up these Go Gear travel tubes. Um, this guy is 1.25 fluid ounces. This is two fluid ounces. And then this guy is three fluid ounces. So I don't think I'm going to use the three fluid ounce because I just don't know what I would put in there. Um, but I'll probably use this guy maybe for like eye makeup remover. Would it stay in there? I don't know. I feel like this is such a liquidy product that, but I don't need that much. So maybe this will be like eye makeup remover or something. Um, and then this is the one that I'm going to put the body makeup in. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, I'm actually gonna set you up here just because the shadows and the sun looks a little better this way. Um, so I am currently sitting on my ass because I'm exhausted. Um, it is, what time is it? It's 11.36, it's Thursday. Um, I woke up so tired today for some reason, like just dead. Um, and I really haven't like, I mean, I've done stuff this morning, but like not enough to be this tired. Um, basically I just like woke up, had a workout, um, a little bit later today with my trainer. Usually I try and train at like six or six thirty, but she could only squeeze me in at eight today. Cause we had to shift a few days and then I came home, had some breakfast and I showered and I actually applied like so much self tanner on me so i'm looking like a little bit and i'm feeling very very sticky um but yeah i'm pretty much just sitting here having a cup of coffee i'm having an iced coffee because i need some form of caffeine um today this the mm, what am i saying the rest of this morning this morning's over it's like afternoon right 11.30, 11.40, does that count as like morning or afternoon? Regardless, I'm sitting here waiting, um, kind of just like doing some work on my computer. We have an appraiser coming to look at my truck, my car. Um, we got into an accident while we were on vacation last month. It was not our fault. So their insurance is sending over an appraiser to take a look at my car to see how much it's gonna cost to fix it and stuff because they're paying for it, not us. Um, I mean, my car's not really that bad. Like the alignment was thrown off and stuff, but we got that fixed right away and it's like all cosmetic stuff. But I literally had the car for, I'm not kidding, three weeks. And then we got into an accident with a huge semi, semi, semi truck, semi. Um, he basically like, like forced us off the road. What is it? He pushed us off the road? I don't know, whatever. Um, but yeah, it was just like a scary incident, but I had less than 2000 miles on my car. I was not happy. Um, so we're still trying to deal with that. It's been like weeks and it's still not fixed, but that's going to be all whole drama with me having to get like a rental car and all that, but I'm happy it's getting done. So I'm basically just home all day today. I ran all my errands earlier this week. I need to actually pack my bag, like put shit into a suitcase. I have all my outfits laid out, I think, although I need to go find a swimsuit because we're going to like a pool bar now, apparently. I'm not swimsuit ready, so I'm kind of like, but I'll figure something out. I need to find like a cover up and flip flops and stuff. Um, yeah, so I need to actually physically pack my bag and then I think we're going to dinner with some people Nick works with tonight, I don't know. My flight isn't till like, noon tomorrow and i'm flying out of like a local airport so it's gonna be like a 30 minute drive um so i'm not that worried about it i have time um and then i have some other stuff i need to do around the house to help nick prepare he wants me to like spray paint some duffel bags and stuff like that for him which i'm more than happy to do um oh i wanted to show you guys an update on my brows oh they look so good Good 
morning you guys it is currently like 6 30 um i just woke up and got a shower uh to rinse off like all my self tanner and stuff and now i'm just doing some eye masks eye patches because my eyes are so puffy um but yeah it's like 6 30 i'm up i'm ready to go bags are like <laughs> Oh my god, you're gonna be so annoyed with me. Like, I'm so annoying. Why did I vlog any of this? Bags are almost packed, like somewhat packed for the most part, I think. <laughs> um, I just want to throw in like a workout clothes just in case I need to pack like carry on stuff like, oh god my airpods phone charger that kind of thing. Um, just some like last minute goodies like I need to pack This stuff for like touch-ups. I need to put in some earrings. I don't think I packed any jewelry now that I'm thinking about it. <sighs> you guys, why does it take me so long to like go anywhere? This is getting a bit absurd if you ask me. So yeah, I'm just kind of running around doing last minute things. Um, I'm really excited. My sister texted me. She is there already. Everybody is getting there roughly the same time. I think I land at like four. Um, so she's gonna come pick me up and <laughs> this background is just so boring. It's lovely. I can't, I can't, I'm like delirious. I really didn't sleep very well. I don't know why or what was going on. Yeah, I just did not have a very good sleep. Um, I need to go take out my hair. It's been in this towel for like 30 minutes now, I think. Um... If you're wondering, this is, I don't know what brand this is, but it's one of the like the microfiber towels for your hair. I got it off Sephora for like 30 bucks, I think. And these guys are the Pixie Detoxify. They're like a jelly. I love them. I actually have them on my makeup desk, so I usually use them right before I do my makeup. If it's early in the morning, I need a little oomph. And when I fly, I just get so puffy and like just disgusting. So I'm trying to take extra precautions um, I don't want to break out or anything. As you can see, my tan has fully developed and has been washed off. It's looking pretty good. Um, so yeah, that's that's it so far. I need to pick out an airplane outfit, I just realized. So this is trusty airport outfit. This lighting is absolute trash and that's a mess. But I just got some white chunky sneaks, my Pumas. Lululemon the Lions, oversized tee, jean jacket. I was gonna wear biker shorts, but can't find them. And this mirror is super dirty. So yeah, here's a little better perspective. I got this shirt off of Princess Polly, I think. It's just like the Thrills brand. And then Levi's denim jacket, just comfy. And then of course, always a scrunchie. What do you saw? Come on. Hello. Hello. Hi, my brother. Hi. Hi. Okay, Hi. How are you? Good to see you. Oh, 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 oh. Jeez. <laughs> Tiny to see you guys. You look so tan. You look great. I love your pony. Thanks. Everybody's here. Your friends going. What?
Yeah, you are. It's so expensive. I was gonna say it's expensive. Everything is so rare, and you're not gonna see it anywhere else. Should I bring a jean jacket? Do you think? No, you won't need it. I think we're gonna be hot. You'll be drinking. You won't think about it. Yeah, you're right. Okay. And I like your overall showing. It's so cute. Thanks. I have such a bad headache. Oh my god. Yeah, drink orange juice. Okay. Look how cute you are. Let's see your outfit. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Lauren, can we get a little? Yes. Oh, the hair. Work so it, cute. sister. Bride. Bride. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is ooh. my Viking outfit. I'm ready to go. <laughs> Why is it 75 degrees in here? Like actually, it's though. hot in here. Oh, set fan. I don't want to set the fan. Uh, System. Can you pour me a, just an orange juice? Cool. Sorry. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, I figured it out, you kids. What happened? Is the air not even on the whole time? Precisely. Oh. <laughs> Kelsey, you look. He's hung over as fuck. I can't, I don't have, I only have one hand, so I can't work the Zoom. I gotta walk over to you. I was doing fine, and then it's big, and now I'm not doing fine. Yeah. Lex, morale is looking low over here. That's cool thing about this. We, 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 we did, we tried. I wish somebody tried. recorded this in the Uber Everybody last night. Back from the dead, give me a good chug. Got my throat <laughs> Yes. Oh God. Oh God. Here we go. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Significant others. Good girlfriends. Yeah. I mean, are you ready? You're doing it, right? Alright, here we go. One, two, three. Chase your moonshine with moonshine, bitches. Yeah. Oh, God, that hurt. That hurt. No, I don't want that shit. That's a big ass storm that's about to hit us. Yeah, take a picture. 
Siri, this is Siri. Yikes. Wait, can you focus on me now? I sure can. <laughs> Let's get stormy. Oh my <laughs> god, get out. Leave. <laughs> Gloria, are we ready for round two tonight? <laughs> Wait, look at this sunset. I need to show the people. Oh, look at these basic bitches out here. Here, we'll boomerang. Ready? Ready? Keep doing Look at the sky. Oh, it's not even showing up on here how pretty and pink it is. Oh, there it goes. Behind the scenes. Did you get one by No, I did not. That is so cute. Sunday scary. Three people. Thank you. Sunday fucking scary. Sunday. I'm going to vomit. Oh, what is going on with my hair? Me either, actually. I'm wearing this hat to distract from my face. <laughs> I'm gonna sit in the restaurant with my sunglasses on. Actually, no, the, my eyelashes are the only thing that looks halfway decent on my face. I need a paper bag with like eye cutouts. <laughs> Everybody get milkshakes. Oh, that looks good. What is up you guys? Um, it is currently Tuesday. I am back. What the fuck was that? Was that a fly? I am currently back home with my babies. I'm so excited. I'm so happy to be home last. So yesterday I didn't really vlog much at all because it was pouring rain in Nashville. I didn't want to bring my camera with me because I only had like a small bag. Um, and then my flight was just like ridiculous. I hate flying. Um, I got delayed and it was just a disaster. We didn't get home till like one. So I literally didn't vlog any of that. I was just like really cranky and exhausted and I think I'm getting sick. I'm just like, <laughs> But yeah, I just wanted to sign off with you guys, conclude this vlog. Um, this was a wild weekend. It was so fun, like amazing. Um, this vlog is, as you probably saw, a little bit PC and like not like the most flowing thing. I actually already started editing a little bit um, and I'm noticing that it is very choppy and like not flowing very well. But honestly, I just got bits and pieces of what I could. He's <laughs> hunting flies. Marshall, you're an angel. Um, but I tried. I uh, also didn't include some things because, you know, some things are best kept as memories for just us and the whole world does not need to see. Um, but yeah, I thought I would show you guys a little bit of what we got up to. It was so fun. It was the most amazing weekend ever. My bridesmaids are beautiful people inside and out. Like, traveled to come celebrate with me just absolute gems i love them all and my sister who's my maid of honor i mean you saw what she did for me it just like it was it was a fantastic weekend she planned everything perfectly it went so smoothly and i just it was literally the best weekend i like get choked up thinking about it like it was just so fun and i was so happy to see everyone and it was just phenomenal. So I'm very glad that I got to share some of this experience with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you enjoy vlogs and if you wanna see more, give this video a thumbs up. I really wanna start doing some more. I've been kind of slacking in the vlog department. Um, but yeah, I just, you know, it's fun for me to share some personal experiences with you guys and stuff. Um, and it just helps you guys get to know me a little bit better and that kind of thing so if you have not already subscribed to my channel i would really love if you would do so so would marshall right papa can i get a paw can i get a paw oh good boy thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video